Hey guys, what is going on and welcome back to the Minecraft Let's Build series. Today we're going to be doing a very, very small modern house for you simple beginners in Minecraft because I feel like the last thing I did was the mountain home and uh, not everyone goes out their way and just builds a fat like mountain home mansion uh, in the hills in Minecraft. That's not something people do. Uh, a lot of people are looking for something simple, but if you are a more complex advanced builder, I do advise clicking off of this because it's going to be a 10 to 15 minute tutorial on a house and we all know a Minecraft masterpiece cannot be created with that amount of time. But if you do want to sit here and learn something very simple and uh, kind of just give you the basics of building a modern house in Minecraft, feel free to stay and uh, have some fun along this let's build. Now, as you can see in front of me, I made like a little plan kind of thing. Um, I feel like it looks, it looks kind of cool. Um, it's kind of the basic shape we're going to be going for during this let's build. And the materials we're going to be using basically are light grey stained clay, snow, uh, birch wood planks and of course black stained glass panes now if you are new around here i am playing on the builds creative server it recently had an update yesterday to 1.9 in minecraft you guys can hop on the ip will be in my description and you can hop on uh, get supporter rank go on the plot world and get building honestly it's that easy um it's a great server a lot of people are playing it we've got a few players right now as you can see abla shivery and uh, all of them cool people doing some uh, like stuff, I guess. Um, we're going to start off with placing one, two, three, four. Okay, so you've got this kind of uh, gap in the center. And we're going to take it out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then ten. And we're just going to leave it at ten, really. Um, I'm going to use no world edit, really, in this tutorial. Um, I feel like I'm just going to try and put that over there and prevent myself using it. I feel like I use it a lot, and I shouldn't. But uh, we're going to take all these up to ten blocks high. Okay, and you're gonna have this kind of shape. Now we're gonna uh, leave, let's see, four and place one, two, three, four, five, six. So you should have a four block gap just there. Okay, now we're gonna come behind and we're gonna place one, two, three, four. And we'll take it out one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I feel like seven should be enough. And then we're just gonna fill this little gap in with uh, birch wood planks. Now, like I said, very, very simple Minecraft tutorial. Um, now what do we want to do? Let's take this out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, we're going to take it up nine and we're going to take it up. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Let's see. I think five could go for now. Let's see what that looks like. Doesn't look too bad. Maybe six. I don't know. Let's see. Let's, uh, let's delete that block here. And let's have a look. I think we're going to keep a six. I mean, six looks more proportionate to the build, I think. Um, and I kind of want to take it out some more. Let's take it out one, two, three. And then take it up to there. Remove these. One, two, three, four is gone. And we'll take this out another one, two. Like so. Now let's take a look. Yeah, I feel like that's more proportionate to the build. Now we're going to take this out by one more, guys. So all at the front is just going to be all taken out. Take that down. Take that down. All of this is going to be filled up with, uh, oh, grey stained clay. Switch to my birch there accidentally. Take all this up, and boom. We should have something looking a little like this. Not bad, not bad. Um, we're also going to take this up by one. So let's see, one more here. Just so it gives us some elevations, because otherwise we don't. Yeah, okay, I like that. Um, let's see, we need to continue this going one, two, I feel like. Then we'll take one two three four five six seven eight nine ten like so okay so we should have this shape and if you see on the mini model over here i pretty much put this little thing down here we're gonna do some kind of garage uh so let's see we're gonna take this back one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen i feel like that would be an okay even 12 honestly now nah, i think we'll stick with 14 and uh, what we shall do is just uh, fix this up. This could be an entire white wall. Uh, there shouldn't be a problem with that. We're going to fill this in. I'm going to try not to use world edit. We're just going to have to uh, go a little bit more quick. Okay, I'm not used to doing this. I'm used to just, uh, you know, typing in a command and all the blocks appearing for me. But uh, I guess this is the way a lot of people have to do it. Um, and if it's going to be a world edit free tutorial like some of you are asking for on my channel... Um, then this is the way it is, you know. Uh, a lot of people are asking for World Edit free Minecraft tutorials. Here you go. Voila. There we go. Fill this in. And there we go. It didn't take too long. Um, so we have this side. And we need to work out where the garage is. Now, how many blocks did I put it from? So I put it two on the mini model. I feel like we should put it like four blocks back. 
So like one, two, three, and then four. And then, no, nah, actually, maybe on the fourth block. And then we just kind of, how long do we want? We want one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's normally what I do my garages. Actually, that's perfect. Now we can bring it down. And we should have something like this. You know, it doesn't look too bad, honestly. I mean, advanced builders are going to be looking at this and thinking, yeah, come on, Lewis, what are you doing? Or Smithers, get on our level. Uh, you know, we have uh, better things to do with our lives than watch with the tours. But 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, we can take that back to join the house. Uh, let's see, take this. Oh, what am I doing here? This is getting confusing. Uh, <laughs> too many blocks. Uh, take this along. It's going to complete the frame of the garage. Fill this in because, of course, no one's going to be seeing that. It's the side of a garage. Oh, all our snow. I can't place blocks today. I kind of just woke up and the weather is really, really good. And I had to wait to record because there was a like a, a grass cutter outside in the street, cutting all the grass in the streets. Because there's a lot of grass where I live. It's in like a suburban neighborhood. Um, and the grass is just everywhere. And they have to cut it. Like the, you know, the city owners, council, or whatever you call it. Uh, they have to cut it. So I was thinking, maybe we leave a little skylight in the garage just to give some light. Is it centered though? No, it's not. It would have to be like something like this, which I don't like really. Actually, that's not too bad. So we're going to go in and just grab our normal glass blocks right now. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. There should be 20 glass blocks in total and it should be very symmetrical to the, uh, the garage itself. Now we've got that kind of sorted, what I wanted to do, as we can see on the mini model, we've got a little birch thing, just kind of chilling there. Um, and I wanted to kind of resemble that in this build. So one, two, three, four. Like so. Let's see, what does that look like from the outside? Okay, it, it does look fairly cool. What if we bring that up by another? But it's out of line with that, which is really going to frustrate me. So if we do that, I bring this out another one, two, three, four. I feel like... It's gonna, yeah, okay, because now that lines up, and yeah, OCD, peoples do not fear, we've got this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Okay, actually, I'm going to take this there, that's going to be a different section of the house. Uh, we're going to take this back. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11? Yeah, okay, and we're just going to join this up here, like so. So now we have a little join up, you know, it's pretty, it's pretty chill, it's pretty chill. Um, what do we want to do here with this? I feel like this shape should continue back, you know. So we can place 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And we're going to take it down to the ground. Boom. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Take it up. And then join it with the top of here. And do the exact same on this side. And I feel like we should just fill that in. Yeah, okay. We're going to fill that in for now. There may be a door for the back door, uh, just there. Let's see, take this up. Boom, there we go. Very, very simple stuff uh, indeed. Now, down here, we're going to be placing, let's see, ourselves a sea lantern, wherever it's at. Uh, just down there, we're going to fill in the gaps here. Place down an anvil, which are chilling. Oh, where are the anvils? Okay, just there. And we're going to place one, two... 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 black stained glass. Just down the side like that. And we've got the anvil down there just to admit some light. You know, so it's not all dark and gloomy all the time. Um, we need to finish this off and take this back. It's going to be coming all the way to here. 1, 2, 3, 4 to join up. Take this all the way back. And I feel like this is going to go... Yeah, it's going to connect into there. So it should be absolutely fine. Now, we kind of want this to come down here, right? Like so... Okay, this shouldn't be too hard. Let's fill this up uh, with stained clay. Boom, boom, boom. Block by block. No world at it. Very, very hard for me. I'm so tempted to just grab my wand and do it, but nah, it's it's cool. I said I wouldn't use world at it, and I'm not gonna. There we go. I feel like that looks okay. And what we can do is then replicate that thing here. Oh, to there. So we have that kind of symmetrical look to the house. Um, we could also replicate this, a so 1, 2, 3, 4, like that. Let's leave a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 gap block, and then put another two there. We're going to have a window there, of course, so we're going to delete these, and delete these, replace that with wood, replace that with wood, 
uh, do our little sea lanterns. Noisy, noisy anvils. And what we can do is place stained glass over the top like this, right? As you can see, very, very simple stuff, but we'll look good. We'll look good in your little Minecraft worlds. Okay. One, two, oh, three, four. Like so. Okay, let's see. We'll take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like this. Fill all this in here. This is all going to be glass, by the way, guys. If you didn't already know, you wouldn't have done because I wouldn't have told you. Um, but yeah, it's going to be all glass. Take this back here to join there. This back here to join there. We should be nearing completion, I feel like. There can't be much left, right? Completely fill this in here. This roof can be filled in with snow. It's very, very simple, you know. The color palette is uh, the... Uh, kind of basic colors. We've got our grays. We've got our whites and then we've got to splash a little bit of like natural color in there We've got the birch wood, which I feel like does work, right? I I hope it works. Honestly, I really do And uh, by the way guys if you would like to go check out an ice cream van tutorial and a little beach hut uh, Very simple tutorials. I've been doing on my channel lately. You can go check them out uh, I kind of didn't do too well on my channel But as long as I'm producing quality content that I'm proud of that you guys can enjoy as well uh, I'm okay with it. It doesn't need to get like, you know, thousands of views um, like some of my other videos uh, This is all gonna be glass by the way But yeah, if you would like to go check them out, there'll be some links in the description You guys can go do that. Uh, it would really help, you know, support my channel. I would love it um, I mean, I'm not one to beg for views likes all of that jazz But uh, you know, they didn't do too well So if you could go like, I don't know, give them a little watch maybe and if you do enjoy them leave a like and so uh, That would be much appreciated Very nice. I feel like this is looking quite cool, you know <laughs> for a starter house anyway not for like advanced advanced minecraft stuffs um do this oh get rid of that okay so we should be ending this on like the 15 20 minute mark honestly hopefully it doesn't go over anything of that nature okay yep that's all completely filled in now we need to just work on the garage i feel like here it's just going to be all cornered off because in a garage you don't really have much on the back. I mean, what is there to put on the back of a garage? Um, in here, actually, the floor can be stone. I mean, what else are you really going to put in a garage on the floor? You could put your cars in here, whatever. I've got plenty of vehicle tutorials on my channel. Uh, so there's uh, Builds, uh, Andy Corrales. Everyone has vehicle tutorials you can go follow. Uh, Zaris HD also is very, very well known for his vehicles in Minecraft. Um, he's done a lot of them. And I'm, I mean a lot of vehicles in Minecraft. He's like... Probably the vehicle guy uh, In terms of how many he's done and he doesn't really do the same sort of style as everyone else He has like his own style, but yeah flooring in the garage is a good one. Uh, let's take this back. Oh, what, what's happening here? Okay, that's fine. Take this back all the way like so and Then what can happen here is that can join there we can have our little Texture we can have our sea lantern our anvil and then our black stained glass filling in this section of the house there. So we kind of have it like symmetrical to the other side. And I like that. I'm, you know, I'm one for symmetrical builds. I really am. Cover this in. Like so. Uh, very nice. Okay, now what do we want to do? We need to be careful what we do right here. Um, so as you walk in the house, this is what we're going to be having. What color floor do we want? That's all. Oh, we need to fill in this little area here. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to fill that in with snow right there. Cover that in. One, two, and then we're going to have a window here, right? Very, very simple, but we're going to do it for the minerals. Uh, one, two, three, four. Fill in with some glass just to make the world go round. And we need something there. So it's always just, you know, better to put a window there than nothing. A plain wall isn't always the best. See, there we go. It just adds something little. I mean,. Not too great, not too great, but it, it will do for now. Fill this in here, and I feel like for the roof, we should just do snow, honestly. Yeah, I'm just going to fill in a snow ceiling because otherwise we're going to have connected textures. And by the way, just a tip for creative building. If you're going to have a connected texture, and if you don't know what I mean by connected texture, is this. Like in the middle of your builds. You don't want that. You want to kind of have shapes. You want to have elevations to separate the textures. Um, that's why this house isn't flat, of course, because you'd have a lot of connected textures. This doesn't count, like snow onto the ground like this, above each other. But, you know, when they're below, 
um, it's not always pleasant to see, honestly. Uh, so just avoid doing that. I try to in your builds, guys. Um, a lot of people say, like, what is that on my build? I mean, I'm not the best critic. I don't, like, criticize everyone, but I would say avoid connected textures. Okay, so what we need to do is fill in this roof here. Uh, yeah, I think we're just going to go and fill it all in. Like so. We should be good. There we go. There we go. Okay. We're going to fill this in with two, right? We're going to have two. Maybe we should put it there. Yeah, we're going to have it there. We're going to have some stone. Oh, no. Stone just coming in like that. And honestly, we should be good. We could put a window in one of these, maybe. I don't know. I don't know if I like that. Um, we could put a firm, maybe. Just in there like this. Just kind of spice things up. Yeah, okay, that doesn't look too bad. I mean, you know, it's old Minecraft style. It's pretty good. Um, what we can do here is add a little trap door. Because um, it's symmetrical, the garage, which is perfect. On the back, uh, let's see. Okay, we need a back door. So, one, two. I think we could just kind of replicate the other side, right? So, we do a two there. Then we have our, like, three block gap. Oh, that's a three block gap. We need to do that. And fill that in there. We can have a window back here as well. I mean, not going to change much uh where's our stone gone where's our stone whack it down there very nice very nice um we could also put a window in up here but i mean is that really gonna do much one one two three one two three like that now nah, it's gonna have to be free wide for my ocd's sake guys there we go okay we've got that going in Jumping in on here, we're going to have to put a flooring in. I feel like I'm going to go for spruce wood. Now, a lot of you guys maybe disagree, but I feel like having the same, like a snow thing, just it just wouldn't look too good. Um, also, a stone floor, not really feeling that for this build, I don't think. Sorry if you can hear my clicking, it's very loud because I have to delete a lot of blocks in a quick amount of time. So we don't like, you know, spend hours and hours deleting blocks and shit. We no longer have World Out on the plot worlds as a supporter in chat. No, we don't. Or well, you guys don't. Because uh, a lot of people were being very uh, irresponsible. I'm actually going to turn chat off. I didn't realize it was on. So sorry about that if you've been seeing some weird stuff in chat. Don't really know. haven't been paying attention to it. Hopefully, you guys won't have uh, you know, been seeing it yourselves. But yeah, basically, I'm just going to give a backstory whilst I fill in this floor. Um, with Sprucewood, guys, if you want to follow. Um, basically, supporter ranks. Uh, a few people came on, started griefing with their world edit. We gave them the opportunity to impress us with some world edit use. Uh, and, you know, make some good builds. But a lot of people just uh, kept um, messing up. And, you know, we give you the responsibility. We don't expect you to throw it back in our faces and kind of uh, start griefing it. But a lot of people did. And it's a shame because we wanted to see what they could do with world edit, of course. But, unfortunately, uh, that couldn't happen. So, we're going to grab, uh, uh, we need a staircase. We do need a staircase. Uh, that's going to be something we're going to be doing here. One, I feel like, yeah, I feel like this is the best way to take it up. Just, if you don't know what this is, this is the Wok texture pack, by the way. The Wok 1.9 flows. Um, I'll put a link in my description, or it will be in my description. You guys can remember. Uh, let's see. Do we want to put a little, like, that there? I feel like that'll work okay. And then to avoid that connected texture, like I said earlier, you don't want connected textures. Um, we can have this going here, right? We can have these just chilling like that. That like that. And that all makes a pretty solid staircase. And then what we could do is come and grab our acacia fence and one, two, and three. And that'll give us a staircase. It's uh it's a little bit derpy, but it is good. We could world edit here. Um with 1.9, actually, I'm pretty sure you can. Oh, you can, like, stack. Oh, you can. Okay. That's that's okay, that's okay. Wait, I'm pretty sure of World Edit, you can actually just float these trapdoors. Like, legit as well. Which is amazing, because now we can make stuff like this in 1.9. Okay, that's brilliant. Oh, you guys are going to get a nice tutorial. Okay. <laughs> right. Do that there, that there. Boom. Just to fill it up, you know. I mean, it's it's derpy, kind of. But it's 1.9 and it works. Yeah, at least it works. We can take that in there. You have a nice little freaking staircase. I like that, you know. That's not too bad. Maybe not that. That kind of frustrates me a little bit. Okay, well, we'll finish that out. But you have a staircase there and it works, right? You have 
front door here perfect and uh, i mean what you could do is add a few things out the front let's see we can grab our dirt and our coarse dirt and what you can do to mix like up the palette is just uh delete some blocks replace it with the dirt and then get the normal dirt like so and then just give it like a little texture mix you know and then what we can do is go in and grab or a few of our stuff our birch leaves our grass and our long grass wherever that's chilling out long grass there it is and we can just place it down you know um just just a little bit random it doesn't have to be like everywhere we can get our leaves jolt them about the place uh place these down oh right, get that down there okay sweet place these all over the patch and what you have is kind of like a nice little garden area uh i i want that there boom you should have something like that you just add so much to the place but we are pretty much done for this house i feel like in 21 minutes we've created something a little bit cool in minecraft honestly you could have a pool down the back here um on the back of here i would also recommend uh doing another one of these little garden spaces um where you honestly just grab your course dirt mix up the texture like i said i know i said it before but some people might not grab the concept uh just yet boom uh, and then of course we have our like long grass and put in whatever you want honestly guys it's up to you um you know i'm just here to give you some advice guidance as you guys can uh spice it up a little bit do it how you guys want um i feel like that will look okay yes yeah, it just adds so much like the shrubbery and all of that jazz um but as you can see this is the back of the house coming around the side we have the same you can put more plants around there little sunroof garage we can't really get into the garage but what you could do is from inside add a little access point to the garage i mean that's not going to hurt anyone is it Put our little thing here connect that with uh with some of that or some stone actually uh walk in here you've got your little thing you can have your little toolboxes whatever your uh you know chests it's, it's really not gonna matter and it's great for survival you know this build it actually works you can do the trap doors because of the 1.9 and you know it's gonna look great in your minecraft world but anyway guys thank you so much for watching hopefully you have enjoyed this video it has helped someone in some way and that's all that i'm trying to do over here on this channel if you did enjoy it make sure to leave a like uh, share this with your friends i guess and uh, subscribe if you're new around here for more content just like this i love you all so much and i'll see you in my next minecraft video goodbye i'm a ghost i call your name you look right through me you're the reason I'm alone and masturbate I've been trying to fix my pride But that shit's broken That shit's broken